Do you want to hear a true story? Yes. Mia and Joe and Sam and I talk, well, now it's text, every single day. It's not a secret. I know that. Every single day. Joe literally, I literally asked Joe, I'm like, because especially Joe and Sam are literally like, it seems like they're, they're together all the time. Yeah, they're married. No, don't spread rumors. They're not married. It seems like they are. <laughs> Man, I, this, 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 this like Instagram crashing is a problem. I guess there's so many, there's so many people that are doing live streams. There's been a lot. Like, I don't know if you see on your Instagram every night. I'm sure there's like four or five going on every night. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, I think a lot of people are doing these lives. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Durango's on. Okay, I, I have to show you something. Okay, go for One it. One of our super fans who on Instagram that goes by Durango Thunder Cosplay made me a custom Susan Grimshaw. Funko Pop? Funko Pop. What? Look at her. That's crazy. Look at her. Durango, that is awesome. I'm obsessed with her. Mwah, mwah. I was that hoping is... Durango would join so I could pull that out. I know, it's the cutest. That is crazy. I know, the detail is incredible. Her Man, it was, so, it was so funny because we were, I was asking Mia uh, like if she has any merch or anything, and then you, like, you kind of saved the day, and we're like, the duck. Oh, yeah, that's right. Those are also from Durango. Yeah, Durango, the Durango duck. You had like, commented. You were very, you were like the director of that, like, that live. Like, you were, there were some things, you, you gave us talking points. Like, you were directing traffic there. That's because I got to keep my bitches in line. So, if you mm -hmm. have Joe or me or Sam, I'm going to be out there trying to whip them into shape. Man, I think one of my favorite moments ever on my podcast was with Joe, where I literally thought, it was just freaking me out because, like, I was just watching a bunch of horror movies in the morning. And oh, I, I ended thought up... this, you thought there was, like, a ghost. Well, man, there was this shadow that scared the crap out of me. Like, it would literally look like um, the Dementors from Harry Potter almost. Like, literally just, like, this, like, really black, like, shadow. And I started I freaking out. I was watching you. You'd be like... No, 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 I'm, fi I'm fine. I'm just kidding. And then you'd be like, oh, oh, actually, Joe, look behind you. Well, no, I went, and then at one point, the best thing is, like, you can see, like, she, <laughs> she, she's answering a question. And you can see, as she's answering the question, she's looking at me, and, and she's like, okay, hey, like, something's not right. Like, he's kind of freaking out about, like, you can see the concern on her face. <laughs> yeah. You, you, you seemed like you were hallucinating. It was it was a weird time. Um, it was it it was it, you know it was it was pretty cool to. Here's the one thing I've noticed: the fan like you guys have a great fans, but you guys are also like the Red Dead Redemption too, like the Outlaws, like, like the Girl Gang. You are also great to your fans, and you know, I'm sure they're you know fan base. Like I've noticed that about the Red Dead Redemption too. You guys are all about the fans. It's about the fans, and you guys are like. When I, like you take the time to answer everyone and collaborate, it's amazing. So I just wanted to kind of point that out there because I don't think it's brought up as much as it should, but you guys are amazing with the fans. So thank you to you, to Joe, to Mia, to Sam, to Roger, to Rob, to everyone. You guys are amazing. I just wanted to say that. We love our fans. You can't imagine what it feels like to work on something for, I was on the game for four and a half years. Roger was on it for like five. And you can't tell anyone what you're doing. You, you, you would say, oh, I, I'm going to work on my secret job today. But you couldn't say anything. We couldn't follow each other on social media. And we couldn't see each other out. So we, when the game was released and the fans just welcomed us with open arms, it was this gift that we didn't see coming. I'll speak for myself, but I had no idea how meaningful it would be to fans. And it has just been this ride, unlike anything I could have anticipated. I was like, oh, I'm going to be in a video game. That's cool. Uh, but I had no idea how meaningful it would be. And I talk to fans literally every single day. Um, and they'll, you know, I had a, uh, I went to a comic con in London and I met a young woman who said that she changed her thesis based on the, the way women were represented in our game. Mm -hmm. No, it's, it, it's Amazing. crazy. Yeah, it is. It is. 
Man, it's I, I like it's great to hear you say that, and it's great to hear you say that. You know, um, you, you know, you're, you're it's a video game, but it it like hearing that stuff. It's like more than just a video game, right? Do you know what I mean by that? Yeah, it is. It is. It's like a. It's like um. It's a transformative experience for people who play. They play as Arthur Morgan, and they really have an experience. And when you think about the fact that the storyline changes based on how you play. You'll have a different ending based on how you play. But that kind of goes to the, op like a little bit of like the open world too as well, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, here's what we're gonna do right now. Anyone, everyone who writes a yes, if we get, I'm gonna count it. If there's eight yeses that show up on this chat, I will start reading dad jokes. That's oh the rule. God. So if you wanna hear them, you have to write yes, and I'm gonna count them. Okay. And uh, we'll see. But I guess people probably don't want me to hear. They don't, they don't... That, do you see that Peter Blomquist is on here and he's calling me a desert flower? No, I didn't. Oh, yeah. Micah, that rat. That's awesome. That's your <laughs> You're also I love very. You, Peter. I love you, Peter. One, two, three, four, five. We're getting close. Three more. I said yes. So I. All right, we're in. Dad jokes coming right. out on the cards. Go. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> I told my wife she drew her eyebrows on too high. She seems surprised. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That reaction, though, that was just like a, that was just like, <laughs> that was just a genuine reaction. I love that. <laughs> There was a snort. I love that. It was snort worthy. Yes. Oh man. Oh man. Okay. I. Oh, this is a good one. Oh no, I'm already. I happy. used to. I. <laughs> oh my God. I. I used to work in a shoe recycling shop. <laughs> it was soul destroying. <laughs> <laughs> oh man uh, <laughs> oh my god <laughs> okay <laughs> oh my god um <laughs> oh, no. okay I'm sorry okay no I'm not stopping we're, we're, we're not we're not stopping our wedding was so beautiful even the cake was in tears <laughs> No, you used that one on Joe. Did I? Yes. Okay. Um, the the shovel was a was a groundbreaking invention. <laughs> um, oh. <laughs> <laughs> the soul destroying was a really good one. Yeah, that was really. That good. was good stuff. Um, oh my god. No, there's I want to because I did quite a few of Joe. I just want to make sure. Did I do the I ate a clock yesterday? It was so time consuming. Did I do that one? <laughs> I can do that one. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, uh, Sam. What's overalls? Oh. You can borrow. Circle back. Joe, I will... Joe's saying circle back. <laughs> what, what's ET short for? Because he's only got little legs. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! This is terrible. <laughs> it's good. It's good stuff. It's good. It's good for the mind. It's good for the soul. Yeah. Um, okay, yeah. we'll do after, one. We'll... After is is good for the soul. It's we'll do. We'll do. We'll do one more. Okay. Okay, one more. So I got. I got to make sure this one counts. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. I, I I hate jokes about German sausages. They're the worst. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> That's it. No more. 
I'm sorry. Okay, the rest it. of this. The, okay, that's it. The rest of the. One more. <laughs> one more. No, yeah. okay. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, no, we're done. No, we, no, no. We're we're not done with the interview. We want to take a few more questions. Um, yes. for because we got about like 10, 15 minutes left. Um, uh, guys, bring in your questions. Yeah, like you, Peter Blomquist. Oh. I see you out there. Yes. But like I'm confused because there's Peter Blomquist out there, so people are saying I agree with Peter, but I don't know if they agree with me or agree with him. It, I don't like this. There's like an uncertain no because like Blomquist is in here. Yeah, he's in there. But I'm also a Peter too, right? Oh, Mandy. So Dan people. Mandy Daniels just asked if I'm going to try Red Dead Online, and the answer to that is yes. But I want to finish story mode first. Sam also just asked the question. What'd she ask? I want to know more about Kylie's day on the SVU set. Oh, I was on SVU this week. Um, well, I'll tell you what was a cool thing about that job was that, um, so first of all, this was a character that I had played on Criminal Intent, Law and Order Criminal Intent, so they brought me back. And uh, I mentioned when I got uh, contacted by production, just that my daughter was a huge fan of the show. And I immediately got an email back inviting her to set. So, um, and she was off school the day that, that I was uh, bringing her. So it was like President's Day or something. So um, anyway, it was just the coolest take your daughter to work day. Lucy came with me. They gave her like her own headset, set her up in Video Village. For people who don't know, Video Village is where um, there's a bunch of screens set up so that people can yeah. watch uh, the Very scene cool. on, on set. Um, so they set her up there with her own headphones and she got to meet all the stars in the show and she was really proud of me. Right, Liz? She was. I think we're all proud of you. Thank you. Um, yeah, so it was really fun. Thanks for asking about that, Sam Strelitz, my girl. I just want to give out a shout out to my friend Adam Sanders. Join Fun Fact. I don't know if you've ever, if you guys have ever watched the YouTube channel called Epic Meal Time where they do amazing, they do a lot of like really cool things. Like they'll make really big, like like cheeseburgers and they just make a lot of really big food. It was huge and viral on, on our YouTube. It was called Epic Meal Time. And my friend Adam was on Epic Meal Time. So I just want to say what up to Adam. Because that was really cool that he was part of that. Because they, they had millions of subscribers on YouTube. They're one of like the first like YouTube channels to actually like make it big. That's very cool. Yeah. Uh, hi, Adam. Uh, someone's asking me if I'm on Xbox, no PS4. Um, and I wouldn't even know how to tell you how to find me. <laughs> it's pretty crazy because I've been doing, I'm, I'm doing about five or six of these lives at night. Like when I'm done like, with yeah. this, I have, I'm interviewing Gianni DeShenzo, who's on one of my favorite shows right now called Cobra Kai, which is like a, oh, uh, yeah. it's like the Karate Kid spinoff series. Of course. Yes. Have you watched it? It's awesome. No, I have not watched it. But it's good. Know. It's it's actually Honestly, really good. That's my generation. But I think the thing about that show, and I think it, you're seeing it with a lot of those remakes, and I'm really curious because I'm like a big hockey guy, so the Mighty Ducks that Disney Plus is doing, like the remake of that, I'm really like, I'm wondering what that's going to be like. Because, you know, they announced Cobra Kai on YouTube Red and everyone's like, oh, like, what if they make it kind of like, because they're announcing, you know, young students and, you know, bullying and everything. What if it's going to be, you know, a bit more cheesy? You know what I mean? They weren't sure, but like, they killed it. Like, they knocked it out of the park. I'm so excited. Okay, good. Maybe I'll watch it. Do you know that I actually got to drink from the Stanley Cup? Really? I did. That's awesome. Yeah. What what year or what team? And who, how did you get well, to? It was Rangers and... um no, what it was a like great like the like the Mark Messier Rangers days. Yes, so we who were was it, who, like, who 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 was the guy that who uh, who was it? Who invited me, Nick Kiprios. Yeah. Nick, I know Nick Kiprios. Oh, I know, hey, I know tell him. Hi. <laughs> I actually, <laughs> I actually know a, like you know you know how they say like oh small world. Yeah, is it a small world, Kylie, or do or do we just know a lot of people? We know a lot of people. Exactly. Right? That's how I say yeah. Like, yeah, right? Like, no, yeah. people are like, oh, small world. You know this? But no, it's like, it's not. No. <laughs> it's, no. It's, <laughs> I just, you know, I know a lot of people. Because you also know, know a lot of people. You do. 
I do. I know a lot of people. I've been in New York City a long time. And I, you know, I'll tell you this about me. I love people. It's like my favorite thing. Talk, this is like my favorite thing. I love talking to people and I love learning about people. Um, I can't believe you haven't told me your whole life story already because normally people do that pretty quickly. Really? Yeah. So oh, wait, I, I'm from what? If I'm high or low honor. Well, high, unless I'm accidentally shooting villagers because I'm trying to like, I don't know, like I'm trying to get on my horse and instead I'm like, <laughs> quick twelve. You know, it's not good. Uh, but I try. I love you too, Peter Blomquist. He loves me. <laughs> um, oh, wait, I've, I'm going to tell you something. Oh, sure. That if you are ever, <laughs> you think it's hard to not laugh at dad jokes, try keeping a straight face as Peter Blomquist starts telling you that you were probably pretty before time ravaged you. Oh my God, <laughs> I was laughing so hard. That was like one of my first, first early days. And um, Peter had me in stitches. I couldn't even do my job. It was a mess. Oh, that, I was actually talking about, cause I, I actually was, it's funny because that reminds me of this. I was talking to my, my friend Lee Arenberg who played in uh, Pirates Caribbean. Okay. And he's the hello puppet, and that's him. Oh, okay. And he was in an episode of Seinfeld, and Seinfeld's like one of my favorite episodes. Of, like, it's one of my favorite shows of all time. And, like, he says there was one clip that he did that, like, literally they had to do, like, 30 takes because, like, they kept laughing at him doing it. And yeah. to the point where he was getting pissed off because, like, he wanted to just, like, all right, let's go. You know what I mean? <laughs> <But> like, <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes, but sometimes once you start laughing, you just can't stop. No, I know. It is pretty crazy. A um, couple more questions, quick questions for wrap yeah. up. Um, I'm so glad we were able to finally do this. <laughs> Me too. Because Me too. I, hear about, I hear about how amazing you are all the time from you know, Joe and me and Sam. So it's pretty awesome. Yeah. They're, um, they're special. I, all bullshit aside, the friendship that I have, not just with the girls, I mean, with the girls, it's, it's, it's pretty rare that you would form a bond that would just hold like that. But all, I mean, all of us, we just adore each other. It really is like a real family. And it's, it's important. And everyone enjoys to do live streams with uh, PD Beats, except for Sam Strelitz, right? Yeah, what, <laughs> what is your problem, Sam? Are you, <laughs> was he inappropriate with you? <laughs> Did he ask you in a way that didn't make I you think feel this, special? You know what? I, it's just, this is just me just, like, giving her a hard time because she kind of, like, everyone else said, yeah, I'm down to do it. And she was the only one that says, she was kind of like, yeah, but I'll circle back because I don't know when I want to do it yet. So I'm just, that doesn't mean she never wanted to do it. I'm just giving her a hard time because that, it's just, it's funny to me. I don't know, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Pick on her. Pick she on never, her. No, she never, she never said, yeah, no, 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 she... Sam, with all, all kidding aside, like, I am joking. Like, like I, because, like, you know what? I don't want to be that guy who, like, razzes on someone so much to the point where they're like, maybe he's serious. Like, maybe he actually thinks I don't want to do a show. Like, no, yeah. I was joking. You know what I mean? I'm sure that happens with, with you, like, all four of you, too, right? The girl gang. Yeah. You sometimes jokes get, like, taken out of context sometimes when people think you guys are serious. Or do, or do you, are you guys all, kind of always on, like, the same syllable? We're normally like totally on the same page. Um, yeah. Now I feel bad, guys. I'm not mean to Sam. I'm sorry. No, no, no. <laughs> all of the comments. I'm just like you're so mean, to Sam. So first of all, someone saying hi from Lebanon, which I just think is the coolest thing. So hello, Lebanon from That's New York. That's awesome. Um, and then Peter Blomquist is saying that he's going to give an extreme hug, which is going to cause extreme pooping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, I don't know why I think that's a lot more funny than I thought. Yeah, Sam, mm -hmm. we're all we're all thinking for you, and 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 don't worry, I'm I, I feel bad right now, <laughs> even though Joe's probably gonna be like, don't worry, <laughs> like Joe's just said, I I say shit to Sam all the time. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna pause it 
something. I think you might have a little Sam crush. That's what I think. And just like in grade school, when you pick on the girl you like, that's what's happening. All right. Am I right or am I right? Well, we're out of time. Oh! <laughs> we like Sam. Everybody likes Sam. Are you kidding me? I, 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 no, I like Sam. I like Joe. I like Mia. I like, I like the whole girl gang. Yeah, but especially me. Yes, especially you. But mostly me. <laughs> <laughs> thank you all for tuning in. And uh, thank you for doing this. I really appreciate it. It's so it. fun.